Well, it is paint day. Got all my stuff set up. My baby's out here drying. Just gave them a little bath. And over here is their nesting box. I just keep one of these little crates. I picked these up at Hobby Lobby. And they're the perfect little nesting box. You can put all their stuff um, in there for them as you're working on them. And I also fill this up with things that I'll be sending them home with. So we're going to get busy. I'm going to start painting. Well, you can tell I live in the mountains. Do you see the windows are open and you still see a shadow? So um, it was like 25 degrees this morning. Anyway, I wanted to share this little baby kit with you. It's Joanna Awake. That's my microwave. Sorry. Um, by Bonifal Baby. It's her little birth certificate. That's a picture of the actual baby right there. Super cute. So this is one of my Christmas babies. This is her little head. Isn't she cute? And I've still got to order her eyes. And um, she will be a biracial baby. She's so cute. And here's our little feet. Little feet. I am sorry about the shadow. This is why I do not do videos so early in the morning. But um, all my boys are at work. So it's just me. Best time to do videos. That's her little foot. Um, here's her little hand. This one's kind of sticking up a little bit. A little bit of a fist there. And uh, her other little hand. I still use these old drawing racks. The ones I started with because they're very cheap. They're only a couple of bucks over on Dolls by Sandy. So, and they're portable. You can just take them apart and move them pretty easy. Here's her little hand. Her little fist. Isn't she cute? So that is the uh, Joanna Wake Realborn. Um, there was another kit this lady wanted, but um, that kit sold out and they haven't got it back in order. So she decided on this kit. So I'm hoping... Hoping I can make the baby look like this. Um, I did bring out my colors that I use for biracial baby. And I usually mix burnt sienna with um, blue and yellow okra and a little bit of black. So I try to go for uh, the biracial babies with the yellow undertones. Now, if I wanted a biracial baby with the red undertones, I'd add a little bit of red to this mix. And you just got to mix it and then test it and make sure that it's the right color for you. Not too dark, not too light. But those are the primary colors I do use on my biracial babies. And another thing I wanted to share was my little detailed paintbrush. I know it takes a long time to find a detailed paintbrush that you like that does those really fine details. And I found this one over at Hobby Lobby and it's a number 10 liner brush and I didn't have to cut it down or anything. And I did take the um, handle off of it because I mostly work under this magnifying glass because my eyes are terrible anymore for those fine details. So when I get my magnifier down here and I'm working on a doll head or something, um, you see I ran out of room. So that's why I cut the handle off of my little detail brush. But that number 10 from Hobby Lobby is about the best one that I found. Um, I also got a number 18 round, but I haven't really used it for anything. This has become my favorite. So if you're looking for a really good detailed brush, go to Hobby Lobby and get this number 10 liner brush. I have other tiny little brushes here. I'm just, you can tell I'm always cutting down my paint brushes to try to accommodate whatever I'm doing. I have several that are cut 
down to do fine whiny like this one I use it for I cut it down and I use it for like my nails and stuff so I hope I have enough fine little brushes to do uh, this tiny little baby here which I'm gonna be working on I am gonna get their hair ordered I have to buy a body for this one and I have another doll that's complete I need to put together um so Anyway, I'm back at my painting table. I haven't been here in over a month because I have been very sick. So all of my stuff has been put on hold, but I am going to try to paint today for a little bit. All right, I will come back and give you guys an update on these sweet little babies. I hope everyone has a blessed day. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye now.